welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's me, Kim Velasco. And for today's video, get ready with me vlog while answering some questions. So, bago tayo mag start, I would like to say thank you to Ever Belena for sending me makeups. They have collaboration with Miss Aramina. And sobrang ganda ng mga products na pinadala nila sa akin, especially the tin. I am using it already. Ayan, sobrang ganda ng packaging niya. Gold yung hawakan niya, and then yung mga letters. I super, super like it. Kala ko nung una, para siyang matte lipstick. But, nang ginamit ko na siya, and then I, I spread it on my lips. Sobrang cute niya. Ayan. And then, ito rin yung gamitin ko, I guess, mamaya. But we'll see. For those people na nakafollow sa akin through IG and Facebook, uh, kung maalala nyo, I ask you some questions for you guys to get to know me more about Dreams, life, goals, how did I start, ganyan. And then, actually, I'll be answering all those questions today on this video. So, if you guys are watching and if you guys are interested to get to know me and para makita nyo na rin yung mga products na gagamitin ko, just keep on watching. One, two, three, fuck it! See, tapos na ako maglagay ng primer and also my foundation. I'm sorry kung hindi bare face ako nag-start because sobrang nagbe-breakout ako. And look, I feel like sobrang laki ng aking pimple nakakaya. But ganun talaga, syempre we're girls and we have our days. If you know what I mean, now I'm just gonna show you what I use as my full face foundation. I'm using Fit Me Matte plus Poreless Normal to Oily Skin with the shade of 120 Classic Ivory. Actually, this is my first time using this and sobrang ganda niya pala. Kasi mahilig ako sa mga lightweight na full face foundation. Gusto ko yung mga full coverage talaga. So, bago tayo mag-start, maglalagay muna ako ng concealer. This is from Aramina package din from Everbelena. This is the stick. Yan, may stick siya. And then, on the other side, ayan, natatanggal siya. Parang cute, no? I think ito na lang yung gagamitin ko. Bago ko maglagay ng concealer, magsasagot muna ako ng question. First question is from me kay Belga. Paano po maging confident like you? Paano ba maging confident like me? I have my days. I'm not perfect. I have my days na sobrang baba ng self-esteem ko. I'm not really confident with my own skin. I feeling ko hindi ako maganda. I have my days. But, to answer the question, I feel confident because I love myself. I love what I'm doing. I enjoy everything that I do. And I think that's what really matters the most. That's why we are confident tayo is because we know what we want and what we want to do. We don't have any doubts about what we want to do in every step of the way. So, yeah. Actually, this concealer is so beautiful. I love it. It's so easy to blend, guys. Sobrang chill lang nung pagka-blend ko. So next, I'm gonna be using a powder. Magpa-powder na ako kasi our makeup today is simple lang. Gusto ko yung malinis lang, light lang, ganon. Second question from Naomi Ornido. Hi, Naomi! Who, what keeps you going and inspires you? Who is my family? What is my dreams and my passion? May passion about modeling, may passion about joining pageants. And my purpose, why I'm doing it. That's what keeps me going. Because every time na, you know, I feel so tired and I feel like hindi ko na kaya. Yun lang yun iisip ko eh. Those things are one of the reasons kung bakit, you know, I still do the things that I love. I strive harder. I work harder. Ito yung powder, guys. Ang cute niya no. Simple lang siya. Black and gold. Nakakatawa. Yung shade niya is Empire. Focus, focus. Usually, kapag nag i ako and masyado akong matagal mag-makeup, nagbe-bake pa ako ng face. Pero, I wanna see kung paano nag-work tong powder na to. I'm loving this powder. Maganda siya. Ayan, ganyan lang guys. Advice ko lang sa mga mahilig mag-powder every time na nag-makeup. 
minsan kapag ka nag-makeup tayo, sobrang kapal na, hindi na natin napapansin. But, if you're just doing makeup for regular days, huwag masyadong, like, super kapal. Okay lang kung ano lang. Like, for example, yung ginagawa ko, like, blah, blah, blah. And also, kapag naglagay ka na ng foundation, tapos, and then magpapatong ka pa ng powder, masyado siyang nakikiki. Kaya may mga makeup na nakikiki masyado. Dahil masyadong makapal yung pinapatong natin. Third question is from Alleluia. Hi, Ate Kim. What's your favorite carbs food? Ako, sobrang hilig ko sa noodles. So, next naman, I'm gonna be using this Aramina. So, merong highlighter and then meron ding eyeshadow. And I think pala rin tong pang contour. So, I'm gonna be using this. Lahat, sa lahat. Kasi, um, kapag may work ako, I use only small pouch lang. And then, nandun lang yung mga kailangan ko. So, ngayon, tatay na rito kung pwede ko siyang gamitin pang contour eyeshadow, ganyan. Para makita nyo din. I'm not a professional makeup artist. Actually, natuto lang ako mag, ano, makeup. Kasi, I do events, nagpapageant din ako, and then, normally, ako lang talaga sa reeling makeup. So, wala. Ewan ko, na-practice ko na lang kung paano. Ganyan. Tapos, pinapanood ko yung mga makeup artist kung paano nila ako may na-makeupan. Paano nila inaayos yung buho ko, yung eyeshadow, paano nila ina-apply. So, dun lang ako natuto. While doing my eyeshadow, magsasagot na rin ako ng fourth question. Fourth question would be from Yeremia underscore of Tiny77. By the way, may I ask you for describe your childhood or growing up from 8 to 13 years old? So, while doing my eyeshadow, I can answer that question. Yung childhood ko is sobrang... Active kasi ako eh. As in, sobrang mahilig ako sa sports. Mahilig ako sumali ng mga, ano, ng mga activities sa school. So, hindi man ako magaling sa mga academics. Ayan, hindi man ako top student and magaling sa mga academics na yan. Sobrang hilig ko sumali sa mga kung ano-ano. Like, slogan making, cooking contest, journalism. Yan. Sinasaliwan ko talaga yan. Kasi... Ewa ko, sobrang gusto ko lang yung mga ganun. Speech, choir, ganyan. So, doon ako active sobra. So, no elementary, lagi akong nasa school. So, even Sunday na school ako kung wala naman kaming klase. Nagpa-practice kami ng mga kung ano-ano, ganyan. So, mahilig din ako sumayaw, ganun. Si mama kasi hindi niya kami pinipigilan sumali. Especially ako, only girl kasi ako. And then, ayun, oh, very supportive lang siya. Most of my childhood days is, ayun, nasa school ako lagi. Ina-enjoy ko yung sa school namin. Yun yung mga activity ko. Kasi kapag ka sa bahay naman ako, hindi naman ako lumalabas. Kasi hindi ako pinapayagan lumabas. Ayun. And then, bago ako graduate ng elementary, I was in grade 6. Tapos, doon naman ako na-engage sa sports. Doon ako natuto mag-volleyball. Kasi, kasi naghahanap sila ng mga players ng volleyball. So, so naisip ko, parang masaya yun na. Try ko nga. O yun, di ako nahihiya, di ako natatakot. So, laban lang ng laban. I'm gonna be using also this shade. Tapos, alay ko naman siya sa under eye ko. question is from New Minion Georgie. Your favorite movie of all time? My favorite movie of all time is... Oh my gosh, ang dami eh. Marami akong ano eh. Wait lang. Before I answer that question, I'm gonna be using the highlighter na. Ito ba yan? Magamitin ko lang yung kamay ko and then ilalagay ko lang siya dito. Sobrang dami kong favorite na movie pero um, pinaka favorite ko would be yung The Bodyguard. And then, yung A Star is Born. Kasi like, yung kay Lady Gaga naman. Kasi sa mga nakapanood na nun, I'm sure makarelate kayo. And, kasi yung partner niya doon is nag-suicide siya. Tapos, in order for her na i-continue yung career niya, ganyan-ganyan. So, for those na hindi pa nakapanood, try niya siya panoorin kasi super ganda. Mga one week bago ko nakamove on, guys. As in, one week. Tapos, one week din na pa. Ulit-ulit kong pinapakinggan yung song. Sobrang ganda. So, next question niya is, your favorite 
food to eat and drink. Kahit kinakain ko, basta masarap. Pero kapag mga lutong bahay, I love kaldereta, sinigang, tinola, nilaga, yan. Yung sa yung luto ni mama and then lutong bahay, yun ang pinaka-favorite ko. At saka mahilig ako sa, ano, sa sabaw. Yung family namin, pati yung mga kapatid ko, sobrang hilig namin sa sabaw. Namana namin siya sa papa namin. I guess I'm done with my eyes. Isa-secure ko lang yung under eye ko. Parang gusto ko lang din dagdagan pa. Next question is, Anong sekreto mo? Ba't ang ganda mo? Ha ha ha. I miss you, Kimi. Kakamiss kayo. Hi, Paul. Sekreto is, just be happy. Just be happy in everything that you do. Do what you love. And be contento ka on what you have. That's gonna be, really, really make you happy. I'm gonna be right back. I sing ka lang yung kilay ko. Hey guys, I'm back. So, as you can see, naglagay na ako ng liquid eyeliner. Tapos na rin yung eyebrows ko. Kasi medyo... Alam mo na, hindi professional. So, nilagay ko na yun. As you can see, hindi siya pantay. So, every time na mangyayari yan sa inyo, take note, huwag kayo magpanic and huwag nyo siyang bubarahin. Pwede nyo siyang idaan sa false eyelashes. So, bago ko magkabit ng eyelashes, I'm gonna answer this question from Ellie Ong Pin. Hi, Ellie. Ayan. How did you start entering to pageants? I started joining pageants when I was 15 years old. Tagakalaokan nga ko. And yun yung pinaka-first pageant ko. So, imagine, wala akong alam sa heels, mag-makeup, mag-dress, and everything. So, doon lang ako nag-start. Pero don't worry, kasi syempre, unong sali ko, hindi naman ako pumasok. Dati kasi may mga cluster-cluster finals pa. As you all know, dalawa yung kalaokan, may north and south. So, tanga north ako. And so, I didn't make it. And then, may nakilala kong friend. Tapos, doon na nag-start yun. So, after the pageant, invite niya ako na, uy, tara, punta tayo sa ganito, salit tayo, bikini open, ganyan. So, doon ako nag-start talaga. Actually, kasi bago ko mag, ano, mag-enter ng college, ayan, so, kaka-start ko lang din mag-model by that time. Hindi lang nang sali, hanggang sa matuto, tapos, every time na may nananalo, hindi ako, like, umiiyak, hindi ako uh, nagtatampo na, oh my gosh, hindi ako nanalo, sayang, ganyan, ganyan, ganyan. Wala akong pakialam, guys. Basta nakasali lang ako kasi yung nililook forward ko by that time is yung pera. Yan, kasi may consolation prize. So, syempre, bata pa ako, hindi ko pa na-realize yung mga ganong bagay. Hindi pa ako yung tipong laban na laban talaga. So, yun lang. Nag-enjoy lang ako. Yung nililook forward ko lang yung ano, yung consolation. Sobrang tagal na pala talaga ilang taon na ako. And then, ang dami ko na rin palang narating. And then, marami na rin palang nangyari sa buhay ko. So, lalagay ko lang yung aking false eyelash. And then, babalik tayo sa Q&A. So, bago ko mag-contour, I'm gonna be answering this question first from AA. Al Santos. Hi! What were some of your plans that changed because of the pandemic? Plans? I don't want to say that I don't have any plans, but my goal talaga this 2020 is to save money and work hard. This 2020, I started doing YouTube and I hope maging successful siya. Yan. So, yung highlighter nito, ito rin yung gagamitin kong pang-highlight sa aking face. Later, maglalagay lang ako ng blush on. So, for the blush on, I'm gonna be using my MAC. MAC blush on. It's Melba shade. Ayan, medyo madumi kasi nakalagay siya sa makeup kit ko. Ayan, I got this when I joined uh, Mutia ng Pilipinas 2018. Ayan, kasi sponsored kami ng MAC by the time. Next question is Lexter Rivera Pet peeves on car shows Wow! Ngayon lang may nag-ask about car shows So that's interesting So actually for those who doesn't know I'm doing events Actually, my pet peeve would be I think yung mga guys Or yung mga uh, nagpupunta sa events na Generally ha Generally na Yung bigla-bigla nag-grab ng waves Maayaw ko kasi at the end of the day, okay, we're the brand ambassadors. We're representing the brand. So I would love to work peacefully and communicate with other people, engage with them, you know, have fun with work. I want to feel respected. 
wala pa naman akong na-encounter na super grabe. So far, yun lang. So, yun lang pinaka-pet peeves ko. Thank you so much for asking that question. And please don't get me wrong, this is my own opinion. So, ngayon, gagamitin ko na is yung highlighter. Ito, guys. Ano pang kulang? I think I'm gonna be putting some lipstick or tint. Kasi gusto ko siyang ibagay sa makeup ko today. Cute siya. Akala ko, ano siya, lip pencil. Binuksan ko na. So, hindi ko pinakita. Then, you have to twist it para nababa siya. Kita nyo ba? So, let's see kung okay siya. Guys, we're done doing the makeup. Thank you so much for getting ready with me. And now we're gonna finish all the questions. The next question is from Chandelier. When are you going to get married, Ate? Wow, sobrang tagal pa, girl. Like, sobrang tagal pa. Because as of now, I'm still building myself. I want to achieve a lot of things. Marami akong gustong may experience before settling down. As of now, I'm happy naman with my life. And ayun, I think that's what really important. Advice ko lang din to all the girls out there to please do not rush anything, okay? Enjoy your life. Gawin nyo lahat ng gusto nyo. Your rules really matters. So, dream big, okay? So para before settling down, wala kayong pagsisiyan. Next question is from Marinella Katangay. Hi ate, paano mo po napagsasabay ang pageants at work? Sobrang hirap pagsabayin ang work and pageants, sobrang hirap kasi first, number one would be the schedule. Same goes with while you're studying and then you're working, then you're joining pageants. Schedule talaga is number one because mahirap eh. For example, you have work ng MWF and then yung mga schedules mo sa pageants is MWF so you have to adjust. Number one, if you're planning to join pageants, you have to set your priorities and make sure na ma-plan mo yung schedules mo. When I joined Miss Bikini Philippines, um, sobrang grave yung schedule ko by that time. Every day yung work ko, as in every day meron, and then sobrang sakto kasi the pageant is only one week. So lahat ng activities is one week lang talaga. And then that time, yung pinakalasi ng work ko, the next day is check in na kami sa hotel, and then dere dere na. So, yun yung pinaka smooth na pageant for me na hindi na compromise yung work ko, hindi ko kailangan mag cancel ng mga events and everything. So, my advice would be, you know, fix your schedules and know your priorities muna. And then, syempre, you have to plan. You have to plan kasi hindi ka naman pwedeng mag-join lang basta-basta at tapos may hirapan ka naman sa work mo. So, you have to balance everything and set your own priorities. Next question is your height and zodiac sign from Vance95. My height is 5'6 without heels and my zodiac sign is Pisces. And so next question is from Ellie again. Hello Ellie, thank you so much for asking again. Sabi niya, bakit ang low mo with the experience, all the influence, and still you remain so humble and talagang walang arte? Walang arte talaga ako actually kasi I started from the bottom. So ako, hindi ko alam kasi siguro batak na ako masyado and as long as I wanted to earn to to support my family and my studies, ginagawa ko talaga lahat. So, hindi, hindi talaga ako maarte. Low-key lang ako kasi what's very important for me is my peace of mind. So, I, I want peace of mind above everything. Okay lang sa akin kung hindi ako sikat. Okay lang sa akin kung hindi ako artista as long as I have my peace. And what's important for me is I'm doing what I love talaga. So, yun. Thank you so much, Ali. 
Um, and then, I remain so humble. I remain so humble kasi actually, niready ko na rin yung sarili ko eh. Kasi when I was starting officially doing events, na-realize ko at that point na if you're a social media influencer, may yun, mahirap eh. Kasi baka may lamunin ka ng social media. Either hindi mo na may kilala yung sarili mo kasi parang nagbabase ka na lang sa sinasabi ng mga tao about you and then gusto mo lang barinig is yung mga good things about you yung mga ganun so, ako ko ito pinasok niready ko na yung sarili ko but I'm not saying fully niyayakap ko na siya syempre may mga days pa rin minsan nakaka-down ganyan pero I think it's part of it talaga pero as much as possible yung mga tao rin sa paligid ko family ko my loved ones they keep me grounded and then lagi nilang sinasabi to always keep your feet on the ground and always look back sa mga tao na tumutulong sa akin when I was starting and behind the scene you know so that's what's really important to me so yeah I hope I answered all your questions oh my god finally na tapos ko yung questions I hope, I hope marami kayong natutunan and I hope sana nag-enjoy kayo while watching me doing my makeup and answering all the questions. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really, really appreciate it. Those people who subscribe on my channel and who keeps on watching my videos. Sana marami pa tayong pagsamahan. And please, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video. Please, don't forget to turn on that notification bell so that you will be notified Every time na mag-upload ako ng bagong video. And please, sana marami pa tayong pagsamahan. Thank you so much for watching this video. I love you all. And I'll see you guys next vlog.